Hey everyone, Scoop Science here. Um, in one of my recent videos, I work hardened these little bits of aluminium, so they're really solid and really thin bits of aluminium. But I was wondering, because when I was doing that, I would heat them up in a little burner here, and they become really soft, so I could harden them, flatten them out a bit more and make them harder. But I was wondering if I were to heat two of them up and soften them, and then hit them with a hammer. I wonder if I could weld these together. So that's what I'm going to try today. So we'll see how this goes. So you can see here my little setup. I've just got these to heat up in here. Matches to like that. And this, I'm using it again with this hammer to see if they weld and stick together. So the first thing is to light this. Go. That is going. Now these two bigger ones here, I think I'm going to try. So I'm just going to pinch them together like that and heat them up. Okay, these are quite a bit softer now, just from heating them up there. So now, and they're really hot, let's go quick. Sit them on top of each other and give it a big whack. Ah, uh, let's have a look. No, they have not, but. But you can see right there, there's a little, it goes up a bit and then down, that's where this was the bottom one, so you can see it's definitely even flattened it out more. And it's back to being really solid. I'm gonna give this another try, see if it works. Heat it up maybe for a bit longer. Okay, I'm starting to actually melt this. Wow, look at that. There's a bit of molten aluminium hanging off this. Gosh, did I weld them? No, they are not. I'm gonna try again. Okay, so I heated them up to 660 degrees, maybe even a bit more. That's the melting, uh, Celsius I would say. That's the melting point of aluminium. So this thing gets pretty hot. And this time I'm actually yeah, holding one of them directly below, one directly on top. So I can put it down straight away as quick as I can and start hammering. Uh, this bit of aluminium up here was just glowing red hot just then. That looked awesome but I t as soon as I see it start melting, I take it away, and by the time it's reached here, it's solid again. That... But then I gave it a hammer, and haven't touched it. It's cooled down a bit. But I think this one's looking pretty good. I may have welded these together. It's, um, it's nice and cold now. Oh, well, I think I may have done it. You can see here, it looks like a bit of a splatter. Maybe some of it was still molten when I hit it. That's probably where the main weld has happened. Yeah, look at that. I can't pry these off. If I tried a bit harder, I reckon I could, but it's amazing. Oh, here we go. Yeah, so right up there where, I, where the little splatter looks. Yeah, it looks like it's splattered. 
from where it could have been molten. That is where the weld has happened, because I can open it up and see that. Well, that's awesome. So there we have it. You can, in fact, weld pieces of metal by heating them up, them up and then hammering them together. So that was a interesting little experiment, I think. If you did enjoy that video, however, please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to check me out on Patreon also if you want to help me make these videos. Um, and don't forget to subscribe to see future videos like this.